hundreds of thousands of dollars in money was being bet between these two guys over 2K and then over cards, right? So they, they claim that 21 Savage has been exposed because he was doing some shit like counting cards. I don't know if it was counting cards. He was like scratching cards or some shit like that to where he knows what cards to pick up in reference to Aiden Ross. So this, is, this isn't even the clip. I got to go to the Instagram because this is like afterward. This is the awkward shit that took place once 21 Savage and his team got exposed for the scam. Am I mad about the scam? I don't know. These niggas got hella money. They're like, who gives a fuck? All right, boom, here we go. You was smiling? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got a fucking ace, bro. No, I don't. <laughs> See, now, now watch him get ace. Nah, nah, I know this shit, bro. You see his homie tap the you see his homie tap the shit, right? And 21 Savage knows exactly what card to pick up. He's gonna pick up the same one as homie sure. tap. Now, like I said, isn't that big of a deal to me? Now maybe I'm Aiden Ross and I'm losing out on hundreds of thousands of dollars and shit like that. Maybe it might be a big deal, right? The internet is obviously killing 21 for cheating. First, or, and, and, uh, taking the weird. white boy money. But you he see it is what it is, bro. Don't be weird. You show up first. I can't lose. Cool. Say da da. <laughs> huh? Say da da. Come on, put it in. Say da da. Da da. <laughs> Fuck! What you have? Queen. That's nah, some bullshit, bro. I don't think you would do that, bro. Yeah. Come on. Nah, they're scratched, bro. They yeah. Yeah. These these cards are both scratched. Where's Look, I'll show you. you. Get the other face cards up. I'm gonna show you right here. Watch. Right there is a little scratch. They're back on two. They're marked, bro. They're back onto what? These are marked. Look. You see a little scratch right there? This one don't got it, though. What scratch? You don't see right here? <laughs> what scratch? You know, you know what the fuck right scratch now. is, nigga. Look, 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 look. You know what you scratch know, is, buddy. Don't play the bull. Don't, be, don't play scratch. dumb, 21. That one right there is a scratch. Man, get the fuck out of here. Am I tripping? Yes. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, let me see the other cards. I don't think you do that, bro. I know you wouldn't do that shit to me, but... I don't know why the fuck it is. Hold on, let me see this shit real quick. Yeah, this one doesn't have it. You tripping. The queen has it. See? Look, look. See the six? Mm-mm. See? See, bro. See, hey, I ain't gonna lie. This, this, right, this right here is probably a perfect example why we be seeing all these niggas dying in these dice games because these niggas be playing games, especially when you're talking about big, big money. Imagine if you had $250,000 down on the table, right? And you was about to lose. And you find out afterwards that a guy was cheating you out your money. Now, I'm not saying you should kill nobody over $250,000. Your life, $250,000. Obviously, some people would kill some people after that. But I don't recommend that. But this is why we be seeing a lot of these niggas die at these games. And these, these card games, these dice games, all the type of shit like that. Because people be playing. So this is what they, this is like the, this is how 21 Savage, I guess, gets exposed by the people. Because on one hand, if you're going to cheat, right, cheat smart. Right? If you're going to cheat, cheat smart. Don't cheat. In front of a hundred thousand people on a live stream, like they're not looking at every single thing you do. You gotta think these kids that are watching this shit, because these kids, they watching everything you're doing. They see everything. They see his homeboy coming out of nowhere, tap the card to pick up. They see you nah, take the wrapper off. This, this, this is unpacking the cards right here. Yeah, nah. Do we have like a table where we could sit like this? Yeah, yeah. a little circle. Like a little circle of a table. Yeah. Here. Over the card. Yeah. He's gonna put a table right here. So, sorry. so boom, he hands the cards off to his homie. Homie goes to get to do whatever he does, right? I guess he goes through, he finds the aces, he finds the kings, he finds the queens, and then I guess he put a little scratch on them. So when you're looking down, you find the scratch and you win. Now, is this some shiesty shit to do? Yeah, it's some shiesty shit to do, right? Uh, 21 Savage, especially a guy that got as much money as we assume 21 Savage has, he probably shouldn't be doing no shiesty shit. Is it a bad look for 21 Savage? Um, do I think it'll hurt him musically? I, I I doubt it. Like, most people who give fuck about 21 Savage music, like me, uh, I don't really give a damn that he's, like, I guess, scammed Aiden Ross. He, after he got caught, he said he was still going to pay him the $400,000 I guess he lost during this entire uh, thing they had going on. But it's just not good for your perception. You don't want to look like a shysty, um, a shysty thief, especially with one of these streaming guys who kind of hold y'all's new young audience in their hands. There's a reason why 21 Savage went to Aiden Ross. There's a reason why 21 Savage went to Kai Sinat. There's a reason why Nicki Minaj went to Kai Sinat because these guys get the most engagement. They have the most loyal fan bases, and these guys want a piece of that pie. So when you go and do things with them, 
don't go on there and do some shiesty shit that people are going to look at and look at you in a certain type of way. And I get it. 21 Savage is the rapper, right? He is the guy selling, what do you do, 150,000 records. He's chilling with Drake. Like, he is a rapper still. But to the kids, and I said this last year, I feel like I said this like two years ago, the streamers are bigger than the rappers now. They care more about the streamers than they do the rappers, right? The only reason I care, feel like a lot of these guys even care about the music, the, the streamer kids, is because they want to watch them, Aiden Ross, Kasanat, Speed, whoever, react to the rappers in their music. And that's why you also see a lot of these rappers, when they when these streamer guys react to their shit, that's like a part of their rollout. That's a part of their thing. They use Kai Snat all over the blogs. Kai Snat reacting to blah, blah, blah music. Now, Kai Snat's reaction may be authentic, but that piece being used as promotion is not authentic. That is, we're doing this for a purpose, right? And even on Instagram nowadays, you could, if you can't tell, if you can't tell the fake stream or not the fake stream, you can't tell the fake promo, not even fake promo, just the promo in general on Instagram, at this point, you're a fucking idiot, right? Clear as day right now, clear promo, which I don't know how this shit works, is this gambling guy. If you follow any of these, no jumpers, shape, whatever, all these pages, and they keep showing this one gambling dude named like Sean Perry, he's everywhere. That's clearly paid promo. Now, I don't know who, and, and I don't know who that works on, but obviously there's a bunch of idiots on social media and that shit works on. So, back to it on Savage. Um, I don't think it's the smartest thing for you to do this. If you genuinely did try to rip off Aiden Ross, now maybe it was in your home. He's like, now nah, we ain't gonna let Savage lose this white boy, this Jewish nigga. He ain't about to lose no more money, this white boy. We're gonna, you know, put the cards in his favor. But then, 21 have to, would have to be privy to it, because the only way 21 Savage would know to look for the scratch cards is if he knows that the cards are scratched. So there's really no way he could not know if indeed he is finding the cards that are scratched. You know what I'm saying? Now, a lot of streaming should be fake. A lot of it be like fabricated. So is it possible that this is some setup? But I don't think 21 Savage would allow himself to be set up to look like a bad guy, especially when he just dropped the album. Like you don't want to look like the, the bad guy in the situation. You want people to keep streaming your music. You want people to keep on buying the albums. You want I'm assuming he's gonna go on a tour. You want people to sign up and you want them to go on your tour, right? So this is the thing that's going on right now. It's a blip in the matrix. It's a blip in the system. Next week, nobody will be talking about it. 21 Savage ain't gonna respond to it. I'm sure Aiden Ross got another guest lined up. He had a great week. This the year just started. He's had a great week. He's had 21 Savage. He's had Soldier Boy. He's had Chris Brown all of his live stream within the past week. And if that don't show you that these guys are the new, the new thing, the stream niggas, they're, they're the thing. I don't know what to, I don't know what to tell you because even without the rappers, right? The rappers obviously add value. They're adding probably like 50,000 more people, but without the rappers, these niggas still pulling like 80, hundred thousand people every time they go uh, live. But I thought this, I just want to play this. Cause I thought this is fucking hilarious. This is from the stream last night, too. So you know how like they got that shit, like t text to chat type shit? Like, hey, guys, uh, we want to donate a dollar. We're going to tell you something. This is these, this is these young ass white boy I mean, kids. subs do. do matter. Chat, I love when y'all sub. Don't get me wrong. I love when you guys subscribe. You guys should subscribe right now. Don't spam we good because you guys should. But uh, let me refresh it. But um, try now, Liko. Um, but yeah, bro, like on Twitch, it's different. People subscribe mm -hmm, bro. because they... The advertisements. Sebastian tipped one dollar. Twenty one. Can you stroke that cock for me, Daddy? Turn it up. Yeah, I got you. Yeah. Bro, the I think the fun, the funny, like the dick touching your diction isn't funny, but the fact that as soon as it happened, turn it off, bro. We can't. We 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 not doing this shit. Like I get it. That shit, white boy shit. Y'all do the gay shit. You got the fans that wild out, go crazy. But we ain't doing that shit here. But like I said, Super Twenty One Savage. Um, I will say just in speaking in reference to Twenty One Savage, I do feel like he did have a number one last week. Again, I'll give to him. His album was back-to-back -back number one. I will give to him. But it is kind of concerning to me that his album is not as highly spoke about like I would assume it would be. And that just goes on to tell me that I believe this will be another bad year in music, not necessarily because the music is bad, right? I never said 21 Savage album was bad. I said that I don't think it elevated him over people that he should have elevated himself over. I just, did. this was telling me that if 21 Savage, I feel like can't get the the conversation really going, I don't think nobody will except for the big, the biggest of the biggest artists, right? We're talking about Kendrick, J. Cole, Drake, um, Future. Like, it won't be, even, even shit, maybe even Future won't even get the conversation going. But it's like, if 21 Savage can't get the conversation going for longer than two weeks, and then also, I ain't speak about this yet, but also, 
the fact that TikTok took their shit off of the uh took took the music UMG took the music off of TikTok, that also is gonna do harm for the music industry, right? Definitely gonna do harm for the music industry because a lot of they shit that go viral on TikTok ends up being viral on the charts. That's, in the 2024, it just is what it is. If you don't see that, you're just a fucking idiot, right? That's it. That's it. So when I see people like, let me, let me, uh, this is.